um, for the longest since high school. Heidi, high school. <laughs> yeah. Um, and also gave her the nickname Bam. Kinda annoying girl, but surprisingly, you'll feel that you can't live without her. We need her. Nah. How the heck will be able to pull a perfect vacation gateway, both local and international, right? With alphabetized itineraries, hotel Airbnbs with mid to high service review, color coded price rates, with links and pictures, right? And be able to map out where and what to do. Only BAM can do that seamlessly. One rainy day of July 2018, she swiped right. That's when she started not showing up. <laughs> we are receiving last-minute cancellation on planned dinners and parties. Chat groups gone empty. Seen but not responded to. Most irritating part, I know this group as well, we are left with no Q3 and Q4 travel plans. She's off the grid. That's when it hits me, Bam is in love. Decided to go way back when he was still a baby. He was a colicky baby, he was noisy, and uh, he loved to eat, and in fact, he has carried that habit up to now. He really loves to eat. Well, I actually met Bam by, by accident in the car park at Santa. Because one uh, afternoon, we went there uh, with my other son in his car, and then we were going to park in Mando's uh, car slot. And there was another car. And then he said, you know, it's a woman's car. I said, no, impossible, I said. <laughs> my son is hearing it. Anyway, minutes later, uh, the couple came down, and then I discovered that, um, yeah, it was a woman who owned the car. And it was Bab. And I'm very happy that uh, after that uh, incident that we, we met. Of course, I've known that and I've been very happy since then. Uh, having known my brother my whole life, I'm not sure I really truly believe that uh, this night would ever happen. <laughs> <coughs> Armando was often one to uh, seek alone time to sort through uh, the many confusing thoughts and ideas that would enter his mind. And I noticed that after meeting Bam, he started to spend a lot more time enjoying life uh, rather than pondering all, all of its many mysteries. I am Renato Uragindin, father of Maria Cristina, and Armando's new best friend. Uh, yes. When I was writing this uh, speech, I look back at all the memories, memories of Maria Cristina growing up. One thing I can say is, is his wonderful daughter, sister, and doting aunt in the world. She might not be uh, very malambing, I think she got that from me. Yeah. So with Mads, I saw the best version of Bam. She would mostly rant about stuff at work, about things or people, mostly people. She doesn't like, but when she speaks about Mads, she's very happy and she is at peace. She's a very caring person. She has so much love to give. So when I saw how she is thriving with her relationship with Mads, I'm so happy that finally she found a person to give all the love to and I know that she's receiving the kind of love she deserves also.
My group advice is that you work as a team, compensate for each other's strengths and weaknesses, no judging of previous mistakes and errors, nobody's perfect, be each other's supporter, uh, to continue to be your own you. Uh, marriage should not be hindering you from anything uh, with regards to your own personal growth, uh, but you know that there's somebody who's automatically going to be the supporter. That's one key thing. Bam asked me new, her friends called her, have always uh, made us proud. And tonight is no exception. I I'm sure her mama is smiling down there, looking at us. Yes, it's there. Take care of each other. I wish you long and happy life together. I love you both. And I wonder when I sing along with you if everything could ever feel this real forever. If anything could ever be this good again. I'm happy that uh, you've found uh, the love of your life and long-term partner, uh, Tabam. Uh, best of luck in, <laughs> in and toast my brother Armando and uh, Bam, the sister I've been waiting for all my life. Uh, and cheers, everyone. Cheers. I love you unconditionally and without hesitation. I vow to love you, encourage you, trust you, and respect you. As a family, we will create a home filled with learning, laughter, and compassion. I promise to work with you to foster and cherish a relationship of equality, knowing that together, we will build a life far better than either of us could imagine alone. I accept you as you are, and I offer myself in return. I will care for you, stand beside you, and share with you all of life's adversities and all of its joys from this day forward and all the days of my life. You will always be my chicken wiggy. <laughs> I promise to love you, to be your best friend, to respect and support you, to be patient with you, to work together with you to achieve our goals, to accept you unconditionally and to share my life with you forever. I choose to live with you as your lover, companion, and friend, loving you when life is peaceful and when it is painful, during our successes and during our failures, supported by your strengths and accepting your weaknesses. I will honor your goals, our goals and dreams, trying always to encourage fulfillment. I will strive to be honest and open with you, sharing my thoughts and my life with you. I promise to love and cherish you from this day forward. Everything could ever feel this real forever If anything could ever be this good again The only thing I'll ever ask of you You gotta promise not to stop when I say you